Well, I think he 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 still kind of have hopes for. I mean, you know, it's that kind of a moment when you have to kind of do. Oh my God, I'm feeling so bad. I I. Uh, it's just uh. No, actually, with Five of Swords, I can see that he is not in a happy marriage. He, he, he's fighting it every single day. He's telling himself, okay, I can make it work because he has nowhere to go. He is very, that hardworking man. I'm not, if you guys have watched, I, I will give a lot of pop culture references here. If you if you have seen you know you remember if you have seen Vikings you remember the moment when Ragnar lost everything and came back to his town and everybody was like booing him and he he you know he's just crushing basically he is uh, crying every day inside his heart he can't even show it to anyone like he's in a lot of pain the pain I can I can feel that pain while while doing the reading it's uh, oh my god it's like he has nowhere to go basically he has made a massive mistake by marrying her and and he's not happy about it let me see what megan feels though what is megan's what does megan feel like the cards are okay Okay, the world card world card in reverse. So Megan isn't happy either. Megan is like, my world is shattered. Come on. Like I expected things to happen in a certain way. Now I'm stuck in this marriage forever. <sighs> like that kind of a feeling. Like she did what she had to do. Don't judge her, okay? She did what she had to do. But um she's not shattered like Harry. Like like Harry is emotionally broken. Like, if I were there, if I were his friend, I would give him a hug and hold him and say, you know, you know, mate, everything's going to be fine. Don't worry about it. Megan, on the other hand, is like, dude, I have invested in a bad share and I have lost money. Like, that kind of energy, right? So, Harry is emotionally shattered and Megan is materialistically shattered. Okay? Um, with the three of cups in reverse I see they don't okay let me pick another card okay with the three of cups in reverse I see Harry has no friends left no friends left no family left a broken man with nothing in his life at the moment nothing like he has lost everything maybe even money king of pentacles in reverse i think he's financially also he's gonna struggle okay their struggle and our struggle is different we're normal people try to understand something even if he has got like 100 millions of dollars it's not enough for him because he's a royal he lived like a royal right you have to understand this if I lived in one bedroom apartment, if I get two bedroom apartment, I'll be more than happy because I never really had a two bedroom apartment. He lived in a palace. So for him, $5 million is nothing. We need to understand this kind of things when we compare our life with the royals. He's a royal and he, you know. Um, well, uh, with the lover card, I see, and this card I picked for Megan with the lover card and the moon card. Megan is capable of finding love again. He's capable of creating chaos with the moon card with another man. <laughs> she's a very, she's um, <coughs> she's she's very smart. She's very smart, very very talented, very enchanting around the men. So uh, yeah. She, she she is capable of cre uh, creating e having another relationship with another man and create a great life for herself. Harry, on the other hand, is doomed basically. 
that's what I'm saying. Will they go back to the okay? So, all right, if any of them are listening to, I mean, if if I'm not, oh my god, the car honking, I'm sorry. So, um, yeah, that's the reading, but what I learned from this reading is do not rush into marriage. Do not rush into a relationship. You need to really understand what kind of a person you are marrying. I'm not saying it's Megan's fault or Harry's fault. It's they ha need to take time uh, before before jumping into the marriage because honestly speaking, it didn't work for any of them. It didn't work for neither. It worked for Harry, not for Megan. Right? You might think it's working for Megan, but it's not. She could have got a a, a partnership more of her likings but she couldn't she didn't get it so um yeah yeah okay i know this question will arise so i'm doing i'm picking the last card will they ever go back to the royal family uh will they ever go back to the royal ways let me see what card comes Uh, with the page of cops in reverse, I don't think, uh, no, I, I mean, definitely not when she's with Megan, no. Megan will try to play the innocent card, the love card, the nice card, the, the, the kindest princess card, but this royal family, girl, if you're listening to this reading, I'm not sure if she's spiritual or anything or believes in tarot reading or anything of, or anything of that sort, girl, this marriage is not going to work for you. It's not going to serve you. It's not going to give you what you're looking for. This is my advice for Megan. Okay? Playing that innocent card, playing that uh, I'm, I'm a nice princess without voice kind of things, doing the Hollywood deals would not work for you, girl. Like, it wouldn't ruin your life, you know? This is not working for you. It's, it's, it's done. My advice for Harry would be, let me see. I do this reading as if they're going to listen to it, but if they do, be good. Okay, Harry, I see Eight of Wand. Uh, you will have to deal with a lot of hatred. People will hate you. People would shame you. People would disrespect. I'm sorry, I don't know what is that noise. They would disrespect you, and maybe this is a sign. Your soul might scream like that for love and care and, and um, you know, I'm so sorry. Every time I'm pulling a card for Harry, I feel so emotional and I can literally feel his pain right now. I feel so bad for him. You know? So... Oh, fuck. Ten of Swords. Uh, he is in a lot of pain, man. He has lost everything. Oh, my God. I'm so sorry. I'm, I mean... I really hope he finds some peace in his heart. Um, um, Harry is going through a lot. Megan, on the other hand, uh, just... Just get out of this marriage and uh, it'll be good for you and everybody else and you will find another person it'll be like you're capable of uh, finding another relationship which would serve your purpose Harry on the other hand have to deal with a lot of pain a lot of shame a lot of hatred a lot of I'm so sorry man I don't know what to okay let me see what advice can I give you save up money okay don't waste them save up some money okay so here's the thing harry if you're listening to this reading or anyone in in harry's situation do not waste your money save them don't because you're first aided don't waste it on women drugs alcohol don't do that save up money okay you will need that that's an advice for you uh 
finding love would be very hard for you anytime soon. I see Ace of Cups in reverse. You have to be the Knight of Sword again, the strong person you were one to one. You know, the strong person you were before. You will have to be that strong, hard-working person with more critical knowledge. Like you need to learn about people. You need to learn about the ways of the world. You need to learn about how human behavior is. Uh, you have to become that strong person again. You have to come back to that persona everybody loved. That Prince Charming, Prince Harry persona. You need to come. And it would take years to build again. Okay? When people compare Harry, they compare them with uh, King Edward, his uh, uh, Queen Queen Elizabeth the Two's uncle Edward. I guess his name was Edward. But don't compare him with him because Harry is more stronger than him. And Meghan doesn't love Harry as much as uh, Wallace loved uh, Edward. I'm sorry to say that. Wallace actually was there for the love. Meghan is here for more. So Harry needs to be strong. He needs to go back to like, he needs to start everything from the scratch. He doesn't have to admit it. He doesn't have to admit, I'm sorry, of course, but it's a great quality to be hardworking, the protector and everything, but you did it for the wrong person, Harry. So after saving up some money, not if you, if you really control your life, don't waste your time, don't waste your money, don't waste it on uh, take care, if you take care of your mental health and if you become that knight of sword, that, that knight of pentacle again, like that, that knight that you are, you will come towards, you will become as strong as an emperor, like as a king. You won't be a king in real life, but like, that king-like personality, you will you can step into it if you work hard, if you do not shatter, and if you do not break down, if you take control of your life, you will become that person and better. Okay? So that's the reading for Harry. Um, okay, my, my listeners... It might seem like I'm, I'm doing the reading for them, like in front of them, but I always, whenever I do a reading, I really uh, wish that they're listening to it. So I, I do the reading in a manner that they are actually listening to what I'm saying. Uh, okay, that's the, so my advice for Harry would be working really hard on himself and do not get shattered, don't let go, and be strong, and then then only you can recover from the pain you were getting. Megan, on the other hand, if you get out of this relationship, you will find another man, you will find another man, woman, whatever uh, you are, I mean, if you want a woman, you can get that too, I mean, I'm not saying she is bisexual, I'm just, you know, when I do reading, I do reading in this in this manner. So she, she can, she, it would be so easy for her to manifest anything. She's a great manifester. So she wouldn't have to do much healing. Harry does. What about the kids though, right? That's the question. So I will pick another card. I got the justice card. I need a clarification with temperance. So... Okay, so the kids need to be co-parented. They're both good parents, though. None of them are bad parents. They're both good parents. So in that area of their life, they need to, like, co-parent uh, nicely. And uh, if, they're, if they're, like, balanced, the, the kids will have a great life. Don't worry about the kids. Don't worry about the kids. They're good people. They're good parents. I mean, the, the way you guys judge them, they're, they're not devil. They're not monsters, okay? They're nice people. Just just happen to take the wrong decisions in life like we all do. What Megan wanted from Harry was not a wrong thing to want, okay? People, people do want power and status. Most of us do. Uh, what Harry wanted from Megan was not wrong either. He wanted a lovely, sweet, caring wife. Megan is 
maybe that or she had like more intentions okay so here's a reading um i really hope you enjoyed it and um uh i'm not i always do this reading in order to um uh, help you guys navigate your life as well because sometimes learning from celebrities life give us a lot of uh, a lot of good uh, you know good advices so i hope this reading helped you as well in personal level and that's it for the reading it's a long reading as i said um i hope uh you liked it and you enjoyed it and i'll see you guys in the next video Mwah. love you